Hello Internet, it's Roberto again, coming back to do another unboxing. Today I got a, another figure that I'm uh, pretty excited about. This time it's Defining Moments, uh, WWE's Stone Cold Steve Austin. And if you don't know who he is, you're probably just too young. I don't know. Uh, before there was John Cena running amok in WWE and all your current crop wrestlers, you had Stone Cold, the original badass, just butt whooper. Um, this figure is pretty awesome because it says it's a defining moment of, I don't know which moment, but he's got all the belts, so you take you take your pick as to which moment. I guess it's supposed to be the WrestleMania where he won it from uh, Shawn Michaels. But um, On the back, you got the bio, and then you got this pretty sweet window box, I guess for people who keep their figs on card still, where you can see the, the back of his design, which uh, is pretty cool. It's got the Bionic, uh, you know, redneck. Stone Cold Terminator head and his leather jacket, whatever, on his leather jacket. Um, but yeah, this this is pretty cool. The side art's pretty good too. I, I like what they're doing here. I can't tell if it's actually just the uh, original posters because I remember this image or if it's a painting of the poster, but whatever, Photoshop probably fixes that all up. But And on the inside, you really can't see. Well, I'll just take them out. Let's just go from there. But yeah, no, Stone Cold... Definitely, definitely one of my all-time favorites. Hell, I liked him back even when he was stunning Steve on uh, the old WCW program. Kicking uh, beautiful Bobby's butt every week and whatnot. Um, back in a dangerous alliance with uh, with Pauly. Back then, Pauly dangerously. But, yep, very cool stuff. Um, let's see if we, what's coming, they got a, what looks like a signature at the bottom here of the box. That's pretty cool looking. And then you got the skulls on the inside card. That's also That's pretty neat. They did a lot of cool work. I, I'm a fan of uh, just box art and design. But uh, let's pop out. We got the, the smoke and skull belt. That's pretty cool. That's... um. I wasn't the biggest fan of it with uh, when it first appeared in the WWE having his own title, but... You know, I'm more of a traditional world champion. Everything's got to be vanilla for me, but I've I've grown I've grown way fonder of it after they did other custom belts. Like I like that belt way better than Cena's or or uh, Edge's poor Cena knockoff belt. And well, let's get this guy out. It's lots, of, lots of cool stuff. We got the rubber bands gonna drive me nuts today again looks like. Alright, now this one maybe not so much. But, we got Stone Cold. Here, let me get the belt out first and just leave it here for you to take a look at. Uh, Stone Cold and it looks like both of his knee braces, his uh, his vest. He's got, he's probably got 316 on here somewhere. Yeah, that means that's uh, the proverb where you just whipped your ass uh, after he won the King of the Ring from Jake the Snake. And then he got both of his knee braces from, I guess, just being too hardcore of a worker. Then you got the, uh, this is the first, um, that was the the Attitude Era world title, which was, I like that one. I, I thought that one was actually uh, better than the first uh, Ego World Championship that's Hogan's belt and Bret Hart's belt and whatnot. Shawn Michaels, I guess, has a claim to it too, but, um. That's pretty cool, the uh, the eagle belt. But yeah, I don't know. Um, I'm probably just gonna have him wear one and hold two, like, cause he's a uh, Stone Cold. What else? What else would he be doing other than whipping ass? The best part about Stone Cold, he comes with all these belts, and when he was the champ, he treated belts like crap. He would just throw them around, whatever, like they were just like garbage, and then kick the crap out of people, drink beer. But yeah, that's Stone Cold. Uh, it used to frustrate me a little bit when he'd beat the crap out of Rock, but who do, who doesn't like this guy? Anyways, I think this is a pretty cool figure. I'm pretty sure his articulation will be cool. I'll enjoy him. My name is Roberto again, and see you on my next unboxing. Thanks for watching.